A story in the Washington Post this week revealing that President Obama knew months before the 2016 election that Putin was trying to influence the results. But Obama took action against Russia only after Trump won. Now, President Trump has not yet taken any measures to punish Russia for their actions, and it's unclear what exactly is being done to stop Russia from meddling in the next election. A lot of new questions for the man investigating this issue, ranking member of the House Intelligence Committee, Democrat Adam Schiff, who's here with me now. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate it. You. Congressman, I'll just start with the fact that the Democrats you are investigating, but a lot of Democrats have been using Russia as a political tool to go after President Trump and the Republicans as well. This week, as you just heard, the Washington Post reported that President Obama knew as far back as August of 2016 that Vladimir Putin was working to elect President Trump. Did Obama fail in his duty to this nation? I think the Obama administration should have done a lot more when it became clear that not only was Russia intervening, but it was being directed at the highest levels of the Kremlin. Uh, and indeed, uh, Senator Feinstein and I were repeatedly trying to make that case to the administration initially when they didn't want to make attribution, they didn't want to pu publicly talk about Russia's role. Uh, and later, uh, after we issued our own statement, uh, and they did attribute uh, the conduct to Russia, I was urging that they begin then the process of sanctioning Russia, the administration talking more forcefully about what the Russians uh, had done. I think that was a mistake, uh, but I have to... Uh, contest what President Trump is also saying because uh, for Donald Trump, who openly egged on the Russians uh, to hack Hillary Clinton's emails uh, and celebrated every release of these stolen documents to criticize Obama, now is a, a bit like uh, someone knowingly receiving stolen property, blaming the police uh, for not stopping the theft. Uh, so Donald Trump is in no position to complain here. That may be true, but let's focus on, on President Obama for a minute. You say it was a mistake. How much were politics at play, meaning fear that people would say that he's getting too involved in a way that would help Hillary Clinton? And should that have been a factor at all, given the gravity of what you were seeing in the intelligence? Uh, it was a factor, and it should not have been uh, the most weighty factor. I think they were concerned about uh, being perceived as interfering in the election, trying to tip the scales for Hillary Clinton. I think they were also concerned about not wanting to play into the narrative that Donald Trump was telling that the election was going to be rigged, uh, even though Donald Trump was talking about a completely different kind of rigging than foreign intervention. Uh, but both of those uh, factors did not outweigh, in my view, and I argued this at the time, did not outweigh the public's need to know. The American people needed to know, and I didn't think it was enough to tell them after the election, uh, but rather, given the seriousness of this, I think the administration needed to call out Russia earlier, and needed to act to deter and punish Russia earlier, uh, and I think that was a very serious mistake. You mentioned what you